Hi, thanks for coming back. It's Matt here again with MyWebRow.com, and today I want to take a look at five websites for nonprofit organizations that won the 2018 Webby Award for a charitable organization or nonprofit category. Um, these websites are beautiful. They, they're doing everything right, it would seem, and I want to show them to you now. I, the reason there's five of them is because each of these organizations has a very different look and feel, a very different demographic that they target to um, make donors out of website visitors. So some of these um, organizations need to accept donations. Some of them are trying to build a subscriber base. You can tell there's going to be different goals when you get to these different websites, but that these are organizations that have invested a lot of time and money in making sure that their internet marketing um, is a representation of their organization as a whole. So let's dive right in. The number one Webby Award winner 2018 for a nonprofit organization was the World Science Festival. So let's go there at www.worldsciencefestival.com. And we see that they are looking to get, uh, gain subscribers is their primary goal right now. But right, right down here you can see they offer the opportunity to donate. So when we land on this website, um, we see this, uh, what is, what is um, essentially a header carousel for images. It's kind of like, and then here there's gonna be a video if I remember correctly. So that's kind of cool. They've got a couple images and then there's this video. Um, it looks good. Uh, I We've all seen better websites, but I think this website is um, an award winner for more reasons than just the landing page and the layout, obviously. This is just a typical WordPress website. So let's scroll down, let's take a look at what they're working with here, like we do. Parallax, is, it looks cool when you do that. Um, here's essentially what are blog posts on their homepage. Okay, so there's really nothing too fancy going on here. Um, pretty basic WordPress build. All right. And uh, you can see if you run a nonprofit organization and you have a lot the need for a, hosting a lot of content, WordPress is a great solution for you. You can see how much content is on this website. Okay. So the actual flag uh, ship um, page is gonna be the World Science Festival page. And so we can go there now. So I just want you to take a look at the winner and you can see how they're doing things. Let's see how they handle their mission. Okay, with a video, smart embedded video. Um, I kind of wish that I could get to my team from there, but here's the team. Very, very, very common now to handle um, a nonprofit organization exactly like this. All right, so good job worldsciencefestival.com uh, for being a 2018 Webby Award winner. Way to go. Um, next is defining, I'm sorry, is a Children International Redefining Giving in a Digital World. So Children International's website can be found right here at www.children.org. That's impressive that they grabbed that domain or that they bought it or whatever they did. That's impressive to me. I like that. Children International, you see this striking full page uh, photography. Looks good. You can sponsor a child right there. Get right to action. Get right to action. Get right to action. Okay, so I like what they do here. This looks great. There's a video. We can see how sponsorship works. All right, so these guys are doing a great job. Okay, that's always cool. We recognize a lot of the little design tricks in here as being tricks that we can implement with WordPress. So cool. So calls to action throughout. Mellow colors, but we can see these are the colors that they've gone with. Um, for whatever reason, they must have some print and some other marketing materials that go along with this color theme. It looks great. It really does, it looks great. Very well done. I just wanna show you what it looks like when you go to sponsor a child. It's really cool what they've done. It makes you really wanna take action. First, you meet some amazing kids. So this page here is a basic, um, just basic HTML5, but look at how they've done it. So you can search, first of all, for a kid, or you can browse through these photographs of kids that you can sponsor. And um, they even list, you know, how long the kid's been waiting to be sponsored. This kid's been waiting for over a year to be sponsored. So very interesting. Um, it's very, um, you know, you're 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 definitely getting involved here when you visit this website. You you're getting involved right away. And then here's where you can see they're talking about making a difference. And very well done. Very well organized. 
Um, I really like what I see here, Children International. Good job, children.org. Go ahead and give them a visit if you get a chance. All right, so the first, um, what they call, uh, what do they call, Honor honorary mention or honorable mention is going to be Global Explorer. So Global Explorer, uh, Global Explorer is a really cool organization. I don't think very many people have heard of these guys, but you go to globalexplorer.org and you'll find their website. And I can see why they're an award winner, not just because the website is beautiful, but also because the concept is, is very original. It's really cool. So the idea here, and I'll just kind of, here, I'll give you a scroll like we do. And so the idea here is that um, ancient archaeological sites are being robbed and looted every day and that we, you and I, can join the force um, in stopping that looting. So it's very interesting, but I want to show you this website is essentially a technology project in the making. And they go with this tiles, these tiles theme is all throughout the website and what you're going to see is the reason for that is because you actually let me close that. You actually take training. They will train you and teach you how to look at little photographs and determine whether or not that photograph um, shows the signs of archaeological looting. Very interesting. So you take a tutorial, you learn how to do it, and then you're right in this. You're right in this little portal where you're literally examining photographs for them, and you're helping fight, helping to fight this problem. So anyway, you can learn more about them here. Great job with the video, the embedded video. I really highly recommend that you guys check these guys out here. GlobalExplorer.org. Okay, so good job, you guys. It looks great. All right, let's get right on to the next one. It's called Yuwa, Powerful Life Story of Girls in Jacarhand. So let's go ahead and check it out real quick. Um, the Yuwa website, or I'm sorry, the Yuwa website is found at yuwa-india.org. And it's a great looking website. When girls know their worth, they're limitless. So this is a great website. Um, you know, this website has calls calls to action throughout, but it's a little bit more mellow in its in its um, its invitation to get you involved. Uh, it's you know, you, you, they want you to know more about the story. It seems, and you can check out a video here, and a very 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 cool full screen um, website here. And I watch as I scroll through here what it's doing. So see, I'm just scrolling through here. It's very cool. And I'm learning about the organization. I'm learning about um, the organization from their perspective. Very well done, though. It's very cool. I love those interactive scrolling um, experiences. Want to learn more experience a day in the life of a Yua girl. How cool. So I highly recommend that you guys check them out, yua-india.org. Um, if you're looking to run a nonprofit organization and you have a story that you want to tell, I want you to study the way that they tell this story. It's really well done. So you would dash india.org. Very good job, you guys. All right, let's take a look at personally my favorite. This one really touched me the most. Um, it's called Imaginary Friend Society. So let's go right to their homepage is imaginaryfriendsociety.com. So this nonprofit organization is really cool, at least from an internet marketing perspective. Um, I won't get too heavy into their cause because I actually get a little bit emotional when I talk about it. But, but essentially, you can send your your child to this website, and you know, kids nowadays on their iPhones and iPads and on their Android devices that they're exploring the internet. And what you would love is that kids find websites like this one. So welcome to the Imaginary Friend Society. And this is really going to be more for the adults, right? Um, this is going to be an explanation of why is your kid on this website. But once they get here, it's really a beautiful thing. They have all these films that they can watch um, as a child that answers the questions um, that they have that they may be afraid to ask or that they may be battling with in their mind. So, And here you can see a, a, a very long list, a, a wonderful list of content here. These are videos for kids to watch. And I imagine they watch these videos uh, on the fly on their mobile devices because each of these videos here, and here we can go right here and take a peek. See, each of these videos here is its own little embedded YouTube. So 
There must be a YouTube channel. Imaginary Friends Society must have a YouTube channel somewhere where you could also send your kid. But they just do a really good job of Ooh. creating interactive Hello content there. for these kids that are The name is so whippling, and I hear um, you must have a sibling. You know what a sibling is, don't you? In case you forgot, so. it means your brother or sister. Anyway, ImaginaryFriendsSociety.com, anyway, I highly recommend that you check out their website. This is another example of how a nonprofit organization can utilize the internet, um, use the power of the internet for good, right? So thank you so much for coming back. It was really great to show you the five Webby Award winners uh, for the nonprofit organizations. And uh, if you have a nonprofit organization, your website should look something like that. If you're planning on generating vo high volume revenue uh, in 2018 and 2019 through your nonprofit organization's website, I highly recommend that it looks something like that. So have a great day. Uh, check me out on Facebook. You can find me on LinkedIn please subscribe to my YouTube channel and I'll see you around. Have a great day. Bye.